Hello and welcome to Guitar Gear Gyan with me, Sal Jakhtani, where we talk about all things related to the Indian Guitar Gear scene. Now, how long it took me to finish that was probably how long it will take me to talk to you about this model number. See how this model number with the serial number. I'll show you what I mean. This is the Ibanez RGA42FM IP-05 serial number 1I, sorry, I1908082958 made in Indonesia. Why, 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 why? <laughs> Just call it something like an RG, man. RG series 1, series 2, that's it. Stop, man. You don't need to do more of this. Ugh. Yeah, whatever. Anyway, before we get to the review, make sure you click that subscribe button and ring that bell to stay up to date with all our latest videos. Okay, so those are the beautiful shots of this guitar. Have you noticed every time you see the guitar, you're like, ooh, I want to know more about that guitar. Mm, I like those shots, I like those shots. So it's a secret. You want to keep the, you know, the customers entertained. You want to keep the viewers entertained. You got to show them some beautiful stuff, man. You got to show them some beautiful stuff. And then you just start the jibber jabber. Don't just start jibber jabbering first. You know, you show them beautiful stuff. I'm giving you a secret. I'm giving you the secret to sales, the secret to talking about products. The secret to grabbing the attention. What can you give me in return? Give me a subscribe, man. Come on, come on. You can do it. You can click that. Click that button. Come on, you can do it. I'm getting something free. Anyway. Enough. Enough. I'm on a different tangent today. Okay. Got the second hand. Lovely guitar. Here are the specs. Those were the specs. Lovely guitar. For the price, good stuff. Tuners, not so nice. Other than that, it's good. Pickups, we're gonna find out. So what we're gonna do for the playthrough, the playthrough Kile Ashwin is gonna go through all the five positions. The two humbuckers in the five positions. Hmm, interesting, interesting, interesting. So as we go through each position, he's gonna label what's going on in the bottom. So clean, crunch, high gain. Pliny, VST, can't go wrong, neural DSP, Ashwin, let's get to it. Thank you. 
That was a playthrough. What did you think? Leave your thoughts in the comment section below. I'd love to know what you think. Is this guitar worth the price? Do you have this guitar? Are you facing any issues with this guitar? It's a three-piece neck. It's not a five-piece neck, right? So, want to know? Has it warped in time? Is it still stable? Leave your comments in the section below. You know, every time you leave your comments in the section below, you help out not only the algorithm in getting us more views, but also you help out other guitarists who are looking to buy this and are not aware of potential problems in the future. You know, my opinion is just my opinion, right? What I'm, what, what piece of, uh, you know, the, what product I've got with me in front of me, I'm gonna just talk about that. So if you have had an issue with this guitar, please, please leave your thoughts in the comment section below. We'd really love to know. And definitely would give, uh, you know, a balanced opinion uh, to people looking to buy this product. Okay, thread ends, magnifique, neck, nice, thinner than that one, but I like that one better because that's, that's been modded to high heaven and, you know, put a lot of work in that one. Personal tremolo, hard tail, can't go wrong. Don't need locking tuners that bad for a hard tail, but it's nice because, you know, string change, ease of use, always better. Electronics seem okay, pickups. Mm. Not so good. Not so good. Gotta change these pickups, okay? I'm not a big fan of these pickups. Uh, definitely go with something with more clarity, something with uh, more power, something, I don't know, put Seymour Duncan's or put DiMarzio's, put anything, just just throw these, not throw these, sell these off, okay? Um, these tuners, yeah, remove them, just put locking tuners, and that's it. That's all you need to do. This and this, you've got a really good guitar. For the price it's at, okay, um, it looks fantastic. Okay, it's a photo finish, it's not a real maple cap on the top. Um, is it, maybe, maybe, maybe there is a maple cap and this is on top of that, I doubt it. Okay, it's definitely a, a photo finish a quilt maple top. Yeah, two piece. Looks sensational, put some nice pickups on there and you're good to go. For the serious gigging musicians, I don't ad advise having three-piece necks. Um, I don't know, it's just me. After I've gotten my RG from uh, that's made in Japan, I always look out for five-piece necks. So I was going to mod this. I was going to put, um, you know, Fishman Fluences in, into this body. But I think I'm going to save those for another guitar. Um, but yeah, I mean, if you're a, if you if you're looking uh, for a guitar in this budget range, there's really nothing to uh, you know to say negative about for this for this instrument. Um, I think you should just go for it. It's, it's the Ibanez RGA42 FM IP-05. Thumbs up. Well done. Well done. I said the name. I said the name. You have my approval. Good stuff.